Dirty Barry? Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> I told you, Jay. I told you. Even a blind squirrel finds a nut. Yeah. Every once in a while, man. I ain't a squirrel. I got 2020 vision, baby. The only nuts I care about are these two dangling between my legs. And that's what I fought with tonight. Heart, nut. Obviously, fucking broken metacarpal, good God almighty. Uh, I'm already in pretty shitty jape. Pretty shitty jape. I'm already in pretty shitty shape. Just because I like to drink beer. But I only have it one hand. Uh, the bike. Ain't gonna do it. Holy shit, anybody who says the titles don't matter in this business can burn in hell. All right, let's be honest. Titles don't matter. If titles don't matter, then why the hell are we doing this? Titles do fucking matter. Titles matter. And the United States Championship matters. It matters. And you know what? Now, juice matters. All of a sudden, presto change You leave fucking NXT, the only place that's supposed to matter. The only place that's supposed to matter. I was told the last thing that I said when I left NXT, Canyon Seaman told me, he looked at me and he said, CJ Parker, I'll actually use my shoot name, no. Joe Robinson. He said, Joe, go out and make yourself a star. Well, by God, fuck, it's taken three years, but I landed on my feet, that's right. Hot boy, I landed on my fucking feet. Fast forward three years, WWE, NXT, all that shit, everything that you guys constantly ask me about, I know because that's what we talk about. That's what we talk about. We talk about WWE. But that's in the rear view mirror now, and guess what? I ain't going back. I ain't ever going back. It's okay, because guess what? Guys like Cody Rhodes, guys like Kenny Omega, more guys like that, Will Ospreay, the big stars, the big independent stars. No, independent, yeah. You can take that and shove it up your ass. They're stars, baby. And I might not be a star yet, but I'm getting there. So titles do matter. And guess what, Canyon Seaman? I'm doing my damnedest to make myself a star. Thank you guys very much. If you got any damn questions, uh, uh, feel free to shoot them. What was that three count like? That, when did that three count hit? What was that? Uh, oh, man, well, I was, I was hurting. I was hurting the superplex, all this, those fences. Holy cow. I was in a lot of pain. I thought, I thought on the Paul Friction, I thought I beat him. And I, he didn't hold, he kicked out of that. I punched him in the face with a broken hand, with a cast. Look at that, who wants to get a shot of that? This right here, under that, that's steel. That's steel, that's why I can't use it. But, you know what? Jay hit me in the nuts. Hit me right directly in the fucking nutsack. One man does that to another man. The rules go out the window, brother. Uno didn't see it. Yes, I used the left hand of God. Yes, I cheated, but guess what? Everybody cheats. Everybody cheats, but I still got a good heart. Uh, yeah, when it went one, two, three, and I realized that one, when I realized that I finally became what I set out to do, what I wanted to do my whole life, be a wrestler, be a champion, I couldn't even cry. I don't even know. I couldn't even, I, it was just, I didn't even, I, I don't know what was happening. I don't even know the emotion. It was all the fucking emotions at once. Do you have a word for that? Because I don't. I was happy. I was surprised. I, uh, I was hurt. All these things. Oh my gosh. I didn't answer your question at all. No, Sorry, no, no, no. but I felt a whole <laughs> shitload of stuff that I can't describe. Uh, and now my hand's starting to hurt more. Does it, does it mean anything to you to be the first American born United States You're damn States right champion. it does. Yeah. It matters, any championship matters to me, but to be the first one, after especially who our first champion is, don't forget who that was, the best wrestler alive today, Kenny Omega. All right, he, then Jay White catches him. Okay, Jay White, he's not Kenny Omega yet, but guess what? He might get pretty damn close one of these days, and I'm gonna be nipping on his fucking heels. All right, Kenny Omega, he's what, 35, 36 years old? Jay's 25, I'm 29. We got a few more years at this, all right? It felt really good, it felt really good. Look at that, those are red, white, and blue, brother. I'm sorry I lied, I said I was gonna come with sparklers shooting out of my nipples and bald eagles launching out of my ass. Well, apparently, there's building codes and violations that can be broken, and I couldn't do that. But hell, I wore three musketeers, hat, light-up glasses, and one of the most flamboyant things ever possible. So yeah, it feels really damn good. Any thoughts on what happened to Jim Ross during the match? I don't know what happened to Jim Ross, because I was on top of my head on, on my sag of dime seeing stars. I have no idea. I know when I got up, the first thing I heard was, where's my hat? And I looked, and he was, there was a Jim Ross without a, without a cowboy hat. That's like, is he all right? Was he, is he okay? He right. Wasn't it fitting though that in Juice Robinson wanted to roll up? Isn't that, per, isn't that poetic? I told everybody, I'll roll the motherfucker up. 
and I will continue to roll motherfuckers up. You know why? Because my heroes rolled motherfuckers up. Shawn Michaels rolled up Chris Jericho, WrestleMania 19. Whew! Bret Hart rolled up all kinds of motherfuckers. Bam Bam Bigelow, 1993, King of the Ring, one, two, three. All right? Owen Hart sat on his own brother's shoulder, WrestleMania 10. Roll up, one, two, three. What's wrong with a roll up? Nothing. That's good old fashioned wrestling 101. I'm a baby face, that's what I'm supposed to do. I'll roll the motherfucker up. I'll continue to roll the motherfucker up. And just when they think, oh my God, I don't want to get rolled up, I'll hit them with the left hand of God and drop them on their sack of dimes with Paul Frischen. All right? I don't think there's anything wrong with them. Sorry, Kobe. Thank you. Sorry, guys. What's that? Yeah, I'd like to put it around my waist. Anyway, would somebody love to, would somebody want to do that for me? Well, oh, thank you. It's good too, because that's one of my hide that hide that fat little belly. Uh, hide that little beer belly. Uh, yes, it is a belly cave favor. Uh, we all need one, man. All right, it's a little loose, but hell yeah. Thank you, guys. Congratulations. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. All right. All good. Thank Thanks, guys. I thought... Hang on a second. Hang on a second. Are you all blind, or did you see him use his left hand? If he uses it, he's disqualified. They said it right before we started the match. Why is my belt not here? Why does he have it? He should have been disqualified. Juice, you know what you are? You're a blind fucking squirrel. What's, this, what's the saying you have? There's something about your nuts and something about a fucking squirrel? You surely cannot be happy with that victory. You escaped. You stole my belt from me. Surely someone with your heart cannot be proud of that. I want my water. 